While the Nintendo Switch is a fantastic little portable games console, the Joy-Con controllers are a little bit fiddly to use. One issue with the Joy-Con is that it's very easy to accidentally misfit the strap. As you can see here, the Joy-Con strap has a lock mechanism. This is it locked, this is it unlocked. The correct way to fit the strap to the Joy Controller is to place the strap in one hand with the metal runner facing up. You need to make sure the symbol on the handle corresponds with the symbol on the Joy-Con. You then need to slide the Joy-Con up the metal runner of the strap until the symbols on the Joy-Con and the strap are aligned. After locking the strap to the Joy-Con, the Joy-Con is ready to be used. To remove the strap, we do everything in reverse. First we unlock the strap. Then firmly holding the strap in one hand and the Joy-Con in the other, we slide the Joy-Con towards our body to disconnect the two parts. Unfortunately, it is very easy to insert the Joy-Con into the wrist strap the wrong way around. You can see that the symbols don't line up, and the wrist strap is not flush with the Joy-Con. So to remove the wrist strap, we first need to make sure that it's unlocked. We then need to place the wrist strap in one hand, and have the Joy-Con in the other. And then what we need to do, just like before, is pull the Joy-Con towards our body. I'm using the same amount of force to disconnect the two parts as I used when I disconnected the wrist strap from the Joy-Con previously.